Hey yo, welcome to the Streamo. That was a song from um Violent Storm, a great arcade game if you've never played it. We're gonna play a prototype arcade game called Chimera Beast, which was never released, but it is basically finished arcade game. I don't know enough about this game or its story to really uh say much. I've just been interested in playing this for quite a while now, so I figured, you know, let, let's, 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 let's trade it out and see if that works. Yes! It is I! Be the hero, man! Oh god, it's loud! Jesus! Loud! Oh, the butter, oh, the butter chat! So yeah, uh, I don't know enough about this game. But I know it's kind of weird and cool, like it. The lights, the flash, they hurt me, chat. They hurt me. Anyways, I've been fascinated by this game, and I've been wanting to play it for a while now, so fuck it, let's play it. Um, my controller. But why is my controller not working? One moment, chat, we are experiencing all the base technical difficulties. I'm pressing the buttons and nothing. One moment, we are experiencing technical difficulties. Uh, I love it. I love technical difficulties, chat. Uh, technical difficulties. Uh, yes, it is I, Harrison Ford. Reminding you that you can buy a new car at Harrison Ford's Ford. Apparently, Paradox Entertainment is doing some sort of, um, thing today. It's probably just going to announce one b billion DLC for, for gums. No, no, we don't, no, no, we don't need that. No, yes, good, he's good, yes, he's good. Hello, yes, it is I. I am here to suck your cock. He's best! Yes, he's good, right? He's good. He's good! He's best cook! So yeah, I guess we're working now. Hooray! So yeah, this was a never release, never, uh, I don't know. I know it's finished, basically, arcade mic game that never got released in arcades, but a prototype leaked on the internet, and here we are right now. Okay, let's go. We're gonna shoot men with our gun bullet. Demon monster. Yes, eat that, my groups. Yeah, I'm John. Eldritch Marine, and I'm here to tell you about my new book, How You Can Get a Lady in Five Steps, Guaranteed. Okay, I can shoot goo bullets. That's good to know. My goo bullets bring all the boys to the yard, and they're like, it's better than yours, damn right. Oh no, my commuter beast! He's got smaller. Come on, come on. Okay, I guess I get hit and I get lucky. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, that's a big Eldritch Nukem. This music is not great in this game. I'll give it. I'm sorry. I, I I mean it's unfinished, right? It's an unfinished arcade game, so it's like, what do I expect? Good thing I have infinite porters, and these lamprey are gonna eat my dick. Yeah, we did it. Hooray! We defeated the lamprey. We are John Eldritch, Eldritch Marine. Okay, now we're fighting little Nemos, and my Chimera Beast has evolved a little bit to shoot better bullets. I'm glad that we've, 
we've evolved to shoot better bullets out of our bullet mouth. Bullet mouth sounds like some sort of metal band name. We are bullet mouth! We here to rock and roll! With our cocks out, we are bullet mouth! This music is not good. So I've been listening to um, Power Wolf again because I'm in that mood. And then I ended up listening to Violent Storms, OTS, and then I listened to A Shadow of the Beast, a video game, which, um, I have no idea what's going on. My dude just grew stingy tentacle arms, and I'm fighting the prehistoric life forms that shoot lasers. This feels very scientifically inaccurate. This feels very scientifically inaccurate. I don't think prehistoric domaloids could shoot lasers. <sighs> can, we, can you please just die, prehistoric domaloid? I have. I have a man who can shoot lasers. Oh yes, of course, it's better shoot here. Prehistoric Nautiloid, you can stop shooting lasers now, that'll be great. I have no idea what's going on in this video game, but I'm shooting men with other men. I don't like these single-cell jabronis here. Okay, now I've 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 gotten children. My, my character has now has smaller versions, well, it had smaller versions of itself. I, I'm confused, utterly. What, okay, I guess my character now is Stingers again. Okay, I'm now fighting that, whatever that is. I'm fighting the Jim Henson's Reject Muppet Monster. <coughs> Die, Jim Henson's Reject Muppet Monster! Tickle me, whatever you are. I don't know, but gonna die, that's for sure. I don't know what you are, and I don't care for you, personally. This game's music is awful. We did it. We killed the Muppet. With our jaw that can launch out of our bodies, which seems biologically... Okay, we went from fish to birds. I feel like there's... Their understanding of evolutionary biology is very limited. I mean, I'm a flying... Whatever I am, exactly. How... How is my... Whatever, it's a video game. Don't, don't think about it. I'm, I'm fighting flying trollobite beetles that shoot lasers. I feel like... I feel like nature and science just went out the window here. I'm finding uh, flying chicken demons and rocket beetles. I feel like this has very little to do with, with biology at all, in fact. I don't think getting hit loses DNA. I, I don't think that's how that works. I'm, I'm not a scientist or anything, but that, but I'm pretty sure that's not how DNA works. But hey, 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 it was the DNA that made me this. <gasps> Where did I get hit by a flying sc What are those? What are they? I don't like them. Don't like them. Goblins. Okay, the flying testicles are attacking me now. 
That'll be on my tombstone. Okay, the flying testicles are attacking me now. Oh, now it's an even bigger flying testicle that shoots laser waves! Do they just have a hat full of enemy designs that they threw? Like, yes, that's with the flying testicles. Die flying testicle. Thank you. I'm sure this is not a bird. It, it seems very. Fuck if I know. Insectoid? We did it. We defeated the fuck. Okay, we went from birds to reptiles. Now we're fighting dinosaur. What's it? Try describing these games enemies and you'll you'll be utterly butterly confused. Why is my tail mega thick now? What evolutionary advantage does mega thick tail give me? Johnny Mega Thick over here and his Maybe now I can understand why this game never got released. Wacky as old propaganda is all right. No, oh, I lost my team. And now the chameleons, they tongue me. Ah, yes! I am Chameleon John, and I'm gonna tongue you. But the laser spiders shoot you. I'm just describing what's happening in the game. That's just what's going on. Laser spiders and fucking... Chameleons tugging you and flying mushrooms that look like cocks! What the fuck? Who designed this? And where can I give them a high five? Seriously, I want to give the people who designed this video game a fucking high five for at least creativity's sake. I mean, flying cock mushrooms, laser spiders, gamma, tonguing chameleons, flying testicles, L Nemo from Finding Nemo, truly a cornucopia of bizarre in this video game. I'll give you, I'll, I'll give you A for creativity. And now we're fighting a multi-eyed crocodile. Because why not? That makes total sense. You know, it's kind of a shame because this game has some good sprite work and it feels like it kind of went to waste when this game didn't get released. But, yeah, yeah, whatever, you know. Chimera Beast makes no sense and that's okay. I kind of grooving with the wacky de schmackety do ness of it all. My flying ship shooting beef. DNA Danger! DNA Danger, the new show from Nickelodeon. DNA Danger, secret genetically modified agent. Coming soon to Nickelodeon. Speaking of Nickelodeon, that new Ninja Turtles uh, animated movie uh, teaser trailer is out, and why does Donatello sound like he's 10 years old? You know, this is coming from a man who has a high voice, so I understand, Donna, Donna Manlo. Mammals, okay? That is that is not a mammal. That is a fuck if I know. So we have flying cock mushrooms, jumping whatevers, flying testicles, Tickle me elmo, tonguey chameleons, multi-eyed crocodiles, laser rocket beetles! Whatever those jabronis are. 
This feels like a fever dream! Yeah, but as someone who likes the Ninja Turtles, I'm just glad we have the live-action movie, you know? Flying cock mushroom. It's the flying cock mushrooms. The, the the enemies from Pikmin. The enemies from Pikmin. Now the sun itself is trying to destroy me. Clearly, I my character is not meant to exist. If the sun itself had decided, yeah, yeah, no, 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 we this this. This whatever does not need to live. The only mammalian thing here has been the moles. That's some bullshit. So yeah, not much else to say. Yes! Ah, yes, Chewie! Ah, cockwalls! Oh, well, that's, that's bullshit right there. I'll, I'll give you that much bullshit. That feels... <sighs> my Chimera Beast yells at me for he is angry at my inability to play his video game that never got released. Apparently, they're making a sequel to Demon's Tilt Pinball, and I'm very excited because I loved that game, and... Yep, the sun is... Uh, we're, we're fighting a dragon lion. A dragon lion. Okay, that's like the most normal thing so far... ...in this game. About, uh, Eldritch Horror. This is some bullshit. This is a... Thank God this game has a life bar. It's all on... <sighs> we did it. We defeated the Lion Dragon. Who has the power of the sun? I'm just I'm just describing the enemies in a clinical fashion. Okay, it's time to fix God's one and only mistake, the British. Okay, this is normal. Humanity, yeah, they brought out the jets to fight this flying kaiju, and that that's normal. If kaiju vid movies have taught me anything, it's that the jets and the Mazer Cannons, that this is perfectly normal for your average Kaiju attack. Yep, perfectly normal for a Kaiju attack. I like those tubes full of energy. Those future tubes full of what looks like lemonade. FUTURE TUBES FULL OF LEMONADE! That's right, we now deliver lemonade right to your house using FUTURE TUBES! What are you, lame? You get lemonade the old-fashioned way? No, FUTURE TUBES! Fucking FUTURE TUBES! That's how you get lemonade in all these days. Oh no. Now I'm fighting some sort of anti-kaiju weaponry. Fair enough. I 
I mouthed it so hard that it died. Okay, that looks... ...vanular a little bit. A little vanular. Why is the tube made out of bubblegum? And why is the robot fighting me? These are Chimera Beast questions. And they're not meant to be answered, because that's just the joy of Chimera Beast. Not understanding. Uh, yes, man. I'm sad this game never came out. I feel like if this came out for the Super Nintendo, Kidney would have loved it for just how just inexcusably weird it is. I mean, this is the most normal part, and we're still fighting anti-kaiju weaponry. This is the normal stage of this video game. You know, the one with the maser cannons, and the anti-kaiju ship mabobs. Nice! I'm fighting nuclear energy now! How did this make my kaiju stronger? We did it. We defeated clean, renewable nuclear energy, America. Okay, now we're in a post-apocalyptic level. Makes sense, makes sense. We're fighting fish. So far, I'm following you. Post-apocalyptic fish, even. And flying post-apocalyptic shrimp. Ah, it's good to know that humanity survived that nuclear war thing I may have accidentally triggered. And they're probably pissed. My tail's gotten big! I've got big tail mode! Oh, well, humanity decided, fuck it, we're leaving this planet. You're not leaving this planet without me, humanity! I'm gonna kill you! For what reason, I don't know. It's my job, I guess. This has to be the world's largest space shuttle. I guess it's carrying all the survivors of humanity, so it has to be massive. That's this the that's the plot I have in my head, you know. Humanity died to the you know the new level. Humanity is extinct. I did it. You can thank me later, Earth. Jesus. Oh, it's a that. So we've had flying testicles, Gamera. Chameleons that lick you, laser spiders, Nemo from Finding Nemo, flying cock mushrooms, anti-mecha kaiju weapons, and this thing. Yeah, I'm gonna high-five whoever created this game's enemies. I'm just describing some of the enemy wackiness of this video game. Come here, Robbies! Fuck you, we don't make sense. We're come here, Robbies. Political description of what's going on. That's enough. Chimera beast. 
It's so weird, you're gonna want it. We swear, we guarantee your money back or your money back. Yeah. We are Jalico. Or is it Jalico? I don't know how to pronounce it. Coming alive, dead or alive, you're coming with me. Whatever the fuck you are. Whatever the fuck you are. Exactly, I don't know. Die, do you die? So tomorrow I'm gonna probably stream Mario Fan Gam. Mario Fan Fan Gam. Mario Fan Gam. Can you please die, whatever the fuck you are? Thank you. Have a nice day. Things a real bullet sponge. This game's been pretty merciful for you know arcade shoot 'em up standards. You're dead, son. We did it. We defeated the, that thing there. We did it. Hooray, America! Chimera Beast. We did it, America. The Eater is defeated. The remaining Eaters are now prey on each other. Okay. Soon they will cause their extinction, returning bees to the planet. Gradually, the damaged ecosystem will restore itself. Okay. We did it. We saved the Earth. We did it. We saved the Earth. Hooray! We did it. We saved the Earth. Good ending. Good ending. Jaleco, what were you doing? I love you, Jaleco. This is great. Um... I'm going to take a small BRB and then we're going to play another video game because this is only like 30 minutes of pure distilled g g whatever. I have no idea how to describe this game. So yeah, we will. Uh, I'm going to take a BRB. It's going to be great.
Hey, oh, we're back, and now we're going to play a little bit, uh, something, uh, normal. We're going to play something normal, out zone, but, you know, that with robots. And a man who shoots robot good! Mission, are you ready? Destroy all of them! Good luck. Good luck. Oh no! Skeletons! Oh no, it's Sands from Undertale. What if Sands was Sands? What if Sands was my dad? What if Sands was my robot dad all along? Sands, robot. So yes, we're playing a perfectly normal video game where a man shoots robots. A perfectly normal video game where a man shoots robots. Perfectly normal. Nothing out of the ordinary here. It's just a Toa Plan video game. Who made pretty good shoot 'em ups back in the day, you know? I don't even know if they're around anymore. Sadly, I don't think they are. Sadly, Toa Plan cannot grace us with their wackity brand of schmackity. Okay, gonna shoot the robots, yeah. Why does my big, thick man, you know, my my superhuman samurai squad over here, get get just die with one bullet and laser? Oh, that's right, it's Toa Plan. That's why. Oh, and my health constantly drains. Oh, oh, Toa Plan. <laughs> Oh, Toa Plan, I forgot about how bullshit your video games can be. We here at Toa Plan want your quarters! Millions of dollars worth of them! Hoot, 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 hoot! That's an owl noise. Soap is slippery, but the water is ice. I've just awoken some sleeper agent out there in the universe. Must kill Ronald Reagan. He's already dead. Ow. Fuck.
Not a fan of this constant health draining bullshit. Well, that's pretty metal. Well, the music is certainly better than Chimera Beast, but it lacks Chimera Beast's charm, that's for sure. I mean, we're just fighting robots. Just normal-ass robots. Where's my flying testicle monsters from beyond the stars out zone? I mean, sure, I'm using laser energy, but... That's like just a normal video game thing from this era. That's the one thing I do miss about retro video games is this the absolute punk rock insanity of them. That's bullshit, and you know it. Why do robots need troop carriers? And other questions. Why do robots need troop carriers? That's a good question. You could just make them fly! You, you could just have all your robots fly! Oh, now I'm down to the puny pew pew laser. Yep, that's... Yep, that's a thing that happens, yeah. Eat this wheeled ro- oh, oh no, my nuclear missiles, I'm out of them. Oh gosh. Oh dang. So yeah, you have to tap the button real fast to shoot good. Hmm, I wonder if my turbo controller... I wonder if my turbo controller would do. Yeah, I have a turbo arcade stick, and um, I'm guessing that's the symbol of the invading army that I'm fighting, you know? That makes sense, right? You know, we're fighting laser robot Nazis or some shit. We're fighting robot Nazis or some shit. Uh, Fighting robot no uh, Oh, I fell down, I see. You can fall down in there, that's great. It's magical, even. I like holding down the uh, button to shoot because it's more comfortable to me. Hmm, I have a thought. One moment, shit. Uh, I want the power of turbo controlling. Is the problem. I want the power to turbo control. One moment. Uh, the turbo controller don't work. Great. And then my man passed out because I was switching controllers. That's 
That's cheap and bullshit, you know? That's bu Oh yeah, and the laser killed me. Great job. Okay, I guess we're shooting the old-fashioned way. By holding down the shoot button. Yes, buddy. Tow a plan can kick my ass and chew my gum. That don't make sense, but you know it's true. Tow a plan does the thing. Tow a plan does the exact same thing as other companies. Tow a plan does. Can't do that on the Nintendo. Tell what plan does. Yeah, but Toll Plan did produce a lot of cool games for the Sega Genesis back in the, you know, the day. Yes, my balls have gotten bigger! You know, out of context, that would be weird, but uh, well, it. Uh, Oh, my green energy split attack was not enough. I just, I like holding down the button to fire, but the robot kills me and my bullets are not fast enough to shoot the den. Den dead. Now this, the, the pew pew tiny laser, yeah, that, that's good and fast, but it's weak like, weak. I need my gun to be strong. Yep. 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 I can really hammer this fire button if I felt like it. Why is it in video games that they always send one dude after an army of dudes? I feel like you need at least two dudes. Oh well, it's video games. Don't need to make sense. It's just how it be on this bitch when Earth. so much more with my life.
Ah, the one bullet that I didn't see when I was paying attention. It got me good. Oh, thank goodness I can at least get to here now. Making... I made progress. Little progress by little. I'm getting better at the video game. I just gotta watch out for the bullets because they're tiny. And the robots will hit me with them. And then my man will die by falling. You know, I don't like the fact that my health is constantly draining. That's a quarter munching move if I've ever seen one. You're lucky you're cool, outzone dude. <gasps> You know, I'm done. I don't care how cool you look out, Zone Dude. That is what we in the business call bullshit. And I'm here to have fun with my video games, not, you know, not get mad at them. So yeah, that's it. That's the stream. Uh, tomorrow, probably Mario fan games. That's it. Goodbye, JoJo's. Goodbye.